Uh, okay, so we're gonna plug in the CWX Mini 15Q series uh, with the CRO2 uh, drawing, like circuit. And that basically means that there's um, this yellow line is always grounded and one of these is normally open and one is normally closed and we attach it pretty easily so oh let's see so there's two of these boxes and i think the one on the left it has valves one and two and the one on which are at the top of the system and the box on the left has valves three, four, and five. Uh, if you're really good at doing the wiring, you can wire them up directly to here, but we use these boxes just to make it easy so you don't have to open the power box. So to, now you can see it's closed. To act, to open it, actually we should have the power off, but it doesn't really matter because the current's a little. Um, ground's yellow. And honestly, I'm not sure if it matters about which one's normally open and which one's normally closed, but let's check it. So it is, the whole thing is powered up now. I'm just checking that the cables stay. So that's valve one. So that means on the control panel, valve one should open it, which it did, yay. Can you see it? All right, open and close. And that's pretty much it. And the idea is when we unplug the power, which I'm gonna pull out the socket. Yeah, so the power went out, but the valve remains open and the whole system's down. So then you can do the drain passively. Just uh, open everything before leaving the shower. But I think that's it for now. Let's do take two.